Yo, what's going on everybody? In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the new logging zone, which is pretty OP, and I'm going to be enchanting my axe and so much more, so stay tuned to the very end because this new zone is really, really good. To start things off, I do have some crate keys that I did get for my skill upgrades, so let's go ahead and open up those. We have 128 Tempest keys, so let's just claim all of those real quick. We also have some extra vote keys and stuff, so let's see if we got anything good. We're definitely going to take the value tickets. We are currently sitting at around 404k value. We did just get 132k more, which is going to help a ton some ranks some pet eggs okay we're gonna be sorting this out we did get an epic airdrop which is pretty insane this is gonna be very very useful we're gonna open up this after i finish sorting out my inventory okay i sorted everything out we did get some robots which we're definitely going to take robots are really really good but now let's open up this epic airdrop you can get some pretty good stuff from this so let's just open up real quick i think we just throw it on the ground right here and let's see hopefully we can get something good we are kind of behind we do need something to help us catch up and we just got so many spawners okay these spawners are definitely going to help let me go place them down and i'll come back okay i put down all these spawners we do have a pretty good setup going right now we might go ahead and put some more scrolls and stuff later just so we could help get some more money from it because we are currently behind we do have 250 mil that we can go ahead and spend on some new spawners because currently we are not making that much money from it i mean we're making a decent amount but we could definitely be making way much more with some scrolls and some better spawners we could buy some witch spawners which i'm probably going to go ahead and do i'm just going to go ahead and do that a little bit later though because our, that's not our main focus uh let's see we got a grinding robot which can definitely help us i'm pretty sure you can put some stuff on that which is just going to be way, way more helpful to our spawners than what it currently is. We did get this XP pet, which is masterful, which is going to give us a 30% XP boost, which is honestly really, really good just for getting some more XP to go ahead and enchant my axe and stuff because we are currently going... Because we are going to go ahead and take a look at the logging section in this video. So let's just go there right now. If you do slash warp, if you do slash logging, it's going to take you there. And I'm currently only in the first one. And this one is not the best, but it is that it does get better as you do keep increasing your level here. And as you can see for the quest, you get some money. You can actually get an airdrop, which is really, really good. And basically to help level up your wood cutting, you just go here and start mining trees. And as you can see, it goes down and you're going to get, if you look at the bottom of your screen, the logging skill will go up a little bit. If you take a look, look at these slash skills, you can get some pretty good stuff. You get some XP boost keys, spawners, and all that good stuff from the skills that you can usually get from all the other skills too. And the main way you can actually level up your logging skill is actually these trees to have the particles around. If I mine a normal tree, as you can see, it's going up about like probably like 10 per tree. But if, if, you, if you didn't go ahead and mine the one with the particles i'm going up way way more as you could tell i think i've almost gone up 40 from that one which is pretty insane when you are trying to level up your wood cutting skill make sure to go in head and go for the ones that have the wood cutting particles around it just because they give so much more xp than the regular trees also while you are mining the wood you can go ahead and get these soul things and in the soul well you can actually get some things so basically from this you can put them in the soul well and these can basically give you stuff i'm pretty sure i don't know the full story to it or what it all does but it is really really good if you do head and go if you do go ahead and get those souls from mining the trees and honestly they do sell for a decent amount the oak log sells for 25 and the dark oak can actually sell for 120 so they are honestly really really good if i take a look in the slash logging i'm pretty sure the maxed one is the dark oak and you need logging skill to be level 120 to go there and it's honestly not even about the money there is just so much in the logging world that you can actually go ahead and find like these souls and the quests like these quests are honestly not bad they're honestly really good especially the airdrop one because you can actually get some pretty good stuff from the airdrops but i I am going to go ahead and grind this zone a little bit i want to go ahead and get the level up just so we can unlock more zones and stuff because the higher level uh wood cutting we are in the more money we're going to be getting from the type of wood our main goal is to get dark oak but that is at level 120 which is going to take a while so yeah we're just going to mainly focus on just leveling up over time but we do want to go ahead and get some more uh wood cutting books because our axe is pretty bad it is just the starter one and with some more enchants the leveling up process is going to be way much more easier so yeah the main goal is actually to level up and increase the enchants on our axe just so it's faster and we just have more enchants on it okay so i've been mining a little bit we did get our skill leveled up a little i did go ahead and hire the helper just so it can help us get some more stuff like that and also when you guys are mining you can actually see this crit particle and if you do hover over while you are mining it's actually going to mine the tree twice as fast so that's something to look out for and also when you are mining sometimes a mob will appear and if you kill it you'll get a soul which you can come over here and use in the soul well and you can get some pretty good rewards and yeah but our main goal for the logging zone is to actually get to the silver sanctuary so if we do slash logging we can see that we are currently in the verdant veil vale, i think that's how you say it and we need to get to logging skill 15 so if we take a look in our slash skills 
our logging skills currently at skills uh level seven which is about halfway there so we're just going to continue mining honestly that's the only way we're going to be able to get to level 15 pretty quick we might go ahead and we did get a logging book so we're going to go ahead and probably apply this on our axe just so it can help us level up a little bit faster and i do want to go ahead and sell all this wood so if we do slash sell all we will, we're gonna make 21k from that which is not terrible we are only in the first zone for the logging but let's go ahead and work to the enchanter so we can actually go ahead and enchant our axe so hopefully we can get a good entry like efficiency or something like that and boom let's just see what we can get from it we do have a decent amount of experience so we should be able to apply okay we have transfuse we have mine faster and okay let's go efficiency that's probably going to be the best one and okay let's see how much it will cost to apply and we do have enough okay that's def definitely going to help us a ton we're going to take that and i'm going to continue mining we are really really just trying to get to the silver sanctuary so yeah i'm going to probably come back once i am at level 15 or in case something interesting happens okay so we're currently at logging skill level 10 and we do have two more books to go ahead and enchant so if we go into the enchanter let's go ahead and enchant those hopefully we get some pretty good books to help get our axe just so we can help get to level 15 a little bit faster because right now it's not taking too long like you can definitely do it really fast but anything will help us if we if it does allow us to mine a little bit faster or just level up a little faster we do have some keys and stuff just from leveling up our skills and okay so we have value ticket spawner we have speed value ticket finder and fortune uh fortune isn't showing up but honestly the only one that's probably going to help is i just want to let's just get the value ticket finder just so it can actually help us and we do have a okay let's go ahead and enchant I'm going to go ahead and put the efficiency first, and it did, looks like it might have applied, I don't really know, yeah, it did apply, and then value ticket spot finder, let's put that on too, okay, I'm going to continue farming, we do have a pretty decent ways to go, we are only level 10, so we have 5 more levels to go, but we should honestly get that pretty fast, we are leveling up a decent amount, and our guy hasn't made too much money, it is only like the first section, so, but yeah, I'm going to continue mining, and as you can see, it is doing more damage to the tree, that's what efficiency, it's just going to help us mine a little bit faster, just so we can get to level 15 quicker, but I'll be back once I'm pretty close, or something else happens. Okay, I just killed a spirit that spawned for me mining a tree, and it did give me 45 XP levels, so if you take a look, if you go ahead and clean that, that's going to help us a little bit and i think we i think that's all we got from it but yeah those spirits can have some pretty good rewards or some of the rewards could just be a little bit mid but they can have some pretty good rewards so make sure to try to kill those if they do ever spawn and be careful because they could kill you if you don't have decent armor on okay so we've reached level 15 for wood cutting and we did unlock the epic airdrop and the silver sanctuary so we i'm gonna go ahead and open up this airdrop i think we could open it up right here and hopefully we get some good stuff from it, it looks like some keys and we got a whole bunch of stuff some pet eggs we got some keys and okay so i think that was pretty much it they are going to do a key on a little as you can see which basically gives me a lot of keys that i'm going to be able to open but i think i'm going to save that for next video we do have some value tickets from our axe so that's going to be very helpful that was for 56k which we're definitely going to take we're steadily increasing our value and as we do keep progressing we're going to be getting more and more value so yeah we're definitely going to take that we do also have some more books that i'm going to go ahead and use to enchant so if we do such work enchanter let's see what actually enchants we get i think the the main one we're focused on is efficiency because that's just going to allow us to break trees even faster we currently have efficiency three i don't really know what the max is but we do have a rebirth logging book which basically allows us to enchant past the max i think right here we're going to go for meteor just because it seems like the best one out of them and okay for the next one let's open it up hopefully we can get efficiency so we have fortune which multiplies drops archaeologist transfuse i think we're going to go archaeologist here because we do need gems we are kind of lacking behind and let's see how much of this we can actually enchant let's start with archaeologist we don't have enough for that and for meteor we also don't have enough for that okay so i think i'm gonna wrap things up there we did unlock a pretty good axe and we did unlock the silver sanctuary so we're definitely gonna take that but i think i'm gonna end the video there thanks so much for watching i'll see you in the next one and peace out